Hey, what's good with y'all, man? Say less, it's your boy Valdez. Thank you guys for tuning in. Make sure you guys check out my social medias. Let me like or follow over there, man. We got the links to the Twitch, second channel, Facebook page, merch, all that good stuff down below. Again, I appreciate it. And uh, yeah, let's get into the video. So yeah, man, look, I said this in the past. Lil Peace Management, bro, their team, they keep finding new and creative ways to, like re-release music for it, like on his honor and stuff like that. You know, a lot of um, management, when uh, the artist passes away, they like release music just like for the heck of it. No, like even backstory, they just, they just blatantly they just want the money and stuff like that. But Lil Peace Management, like they be releasing these like EPs or single songs for just like collection of songs and they'll have like a, like a crazy backstory that you didn't know. Basically, that's what they did. <laughs> they, they did it again, man. They just dropped the EP with him and Harry Fraud called High Fashion. And they got some backstory, uh, Lil Peace Mom poked, well, I'm assuming. Lil Peep's mom really like the one like in control. I don't know if she wrote this, but I think I, 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 it, it, it's good since she probably did. High Fashion is a three track EP by Gus and Harry Fraud. Gus met Harry when he was home in New York for Christmas in December 2016, January 2017. Gus was going to fly back to Los Angeles for a couple days well, after um, New Year's Eve, but he got word that Harry wanted to be, get in the studio with him, so he decided to stay. He was incredibly excited and honored to be able to work with the producer that he admired so much. And then it just goes on to say like they made music together and like their songs have sounded super unique. And also the, there's a track on here called Old Me, which is like a, a song that Gus like made and wrote and da da da, but then Harry like worked on it and reproduced it and made it like what it's gonna be sounding like. So yeah, that's crazy. Harry Fraud is a really talented producer. He has like a lot, uh, like, he has a good resume. Like I know of him even before. Um, so this is, I'm, I'm excited to see a Larry, uh, a little, I said Larry, <laughs> a little Peep and Harry Fraud um, EP will sound like. So all right, man, let's start it off. This is the first track off the project. This is Lil Peep and Harry Fraud, Choose. Let's get it. La música de Harry Fraud. Choose. 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 Just mess the smoke like a vacuum Did had the coke in the bathroom Came back with attitude um, Came back in the new mood yeah. You told me it, you love me, you lying <laughs> Whatever I'm selling, she buying I keep it quiet, she can't keep it quiet I fuck all night, but good weed Hey! I see it. They said that it didn't sound like none of the other music. It does have, I guess, maybe that's the, the Harry Fraud influence. <laughs> it, it do sound a little bit. It do sound a little bit different. I take a pill to she see a new me. <laughs> hey yo. You choose and I choose, both choose. We fuck the bus, that's a they move. You do what I do, it ain't you. Good luck, I'll do fuck to you. Who moves? Choose up, choose up. Hey. Roll up for me, yeah. Two cups, yeah. Show love, yeah. There's no love, nah. She don't fuck with me, yeah. But I fuck, yeah. Hey! Rock with a kiss, my word. Real funny. <laughs> Rock with a kiss, I like it when she squirt. So this music was so this music was created in 2016, 2017. So this is like what? As we're recording, like four-year-old music, like that's maybe, maybe that is, maybe that, maybe that's what's attributed to it sounding a little bit different. But I've heard a little peep music from back then and stuff like that, and you know, I don't know. So I don't know what to get to it, but it's nice. It's, it's a different vibe. It was kind of like chill, kind of like mellow. Peep's a wild boy though. For some of them, he's a wild boy for some of them verses though. But regardless, it, it, it sounded, it sounded uh, very uniquely. But it was nice. I like enjoyed that. All right, so here we are with the next track. This track's called Living Room. Let's get it. Saxophone? <laughs> I got baby bottles in my living room. Hey. I be sipping on, she be sipping so. She be trying 
trippin' on me, I be trippin' shoo, shoo, shoo. So I take that bitch up out my living room Now I'm on my own, hey. I be in that mood Now I'm on my own and I'm missing you So I hit my side, bitch Now I'm eating pussy like it's my bitch I got what you want, I got what you need hey. Yeah, I got some weed she don't love me, but she fuck with Lil P Making bitches scream Ayy hey. My limousine's 1200 for my jeans Keep that pussy clean I got what you want I got what you need hey. Double on my cheese She got double D hey. I got baby bottles in my living room I be sippin' on, she be sippin' so good like, like a smooth jazz So I hit my mama. side, bitch Now I'm eatin' pussy like it's my bitch Ooh, 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 girl Take away the pain with some shoes, girl Every time she see me, she gon' choose, girl I ain't even geekin', I'm just rude, girl On my own planet, it's a new but I'm on my own way My way is the highway Yeah I got baby bottles My way is the highway on. That's a boy I be sippin' on She be sippin' <laughs> so She be trippin' on me I be trippin' so So I can't that bitch About my living room Now I'm on my own Got me in that boat Tough, hey, that was living rooms, bruh that is like I don't was that a saxophone? I don't know what <laughs> I'm not an instrument um connoisseur. Let's go with that. But I don't know, but it had like it had like that smooth like, jazz feel. Obviously it had like like a um some hip hop type of bass and drums and stuff like that. But it, it was like a smooth, smoother track. So this track was the one that was released in 2015. Um well not released, but Lil Peep uh wrote it and stuff like that in 2015 and Harry Fraud revamped it i guess yeah so here we are with this track this track is called old me and it's the last track off the project let's get it i am only but a ghost to the old me crack a bottle make a toast to the old me i remember when i used to give a fuck about you now i can't find it in my soul that's the old me i am only but a ghost to the old me Crack a bottle, make a toast to the old me Oh, that's the old me I ain't picking hey. up when the phone ring Lil Peep, I think I'ma die lonely I think you know me Back in high school, you wouldn't be my homie now you, you always be talking about that You always be talking about like and then last time you said she don't she don't she don't mess with me but she mess with little Pete. Basically like I don't know you, you always be referencing like he know that people probably like there's fake love and stuff around. He, you know, he's caught he was cognizant. I bet y'all didn't think I knew that that word. Alright, let's get it. <laughs> show what you want, show me. Little peep, I think you know me. I am only but a ghost to the old me. Crack a bottle, make a toast to the old me. I remember when I used to give a fuck about you Now I can't find it in my soul That's the old me I am only but a ghost to the old me Find it in my soul That's the old me hey. Guys, that man, that was old me, the last track off the project, bruh. Like, so we made this. I don't know what the original. I wonder what the original track was sound like. Or so, what's it taste say? Hebrew. Let me, let, me, yeah, let me just read it for verbatim, bruh. The third song, Old Me, is a song Gus originally wrote in 2015 that Harry had an impassioned interest in working on and reproducing. Nonetheless, though, this version is tough. It's really smooth. Um, a song from 2015 to sound like not 
Dated? Is that, is, I don't know. Is that the right word? Maybe so. So there you guys have it, man. That was Lil Peep and Harry Fraud High Fashion. Nice little EP, man. Again, shout out to the management. I, I, I said it. I don't know how much music Lil Peep got. Like, I, like, people still tell me that there's still songs I haven't even checked out and stuff like that. that um, and I believe it. But they releasing, like, EPs and then, like, EPs, like, meaning. So it isn't just, like, like, just, like, a single track from here. Like, it's, like, a, like a, a group of work that they, like, re-releasing and like that people haven't heard and stuff like that so it's, it's just dope man I, it's the, again shout out to them i always um enjoy seeing these stories and finding out about these new connections that i didn't know before so it's nice it's dope I, and i'll enjoy that my favorite track look i try to keep this a tradition if i listen to a project i try to tell my favorite track with, with, with like three songs it's kind of hard to choose for for all i don't know I, I i did really enjoy the um that little jazz aspect on living room I'll just leave it at that. <laughs> Let me know what you guys think of the Lil Peep and Harry Fraud High Fashion EP. You guys got a favorite track yourself? Uh, any more tidbits, any fun facts that I didn't know? Let me know all that down below in the comments. Also, let me know what you guys want me to check out, review any of that. I'll be reading all the comments. So, again, don't hesitate to comment. And, uh, yeah, man, I appreciate it. Sorry, y'all. There you guys have man. Make sure you guys leave a like, subscribe, join the game, comment on anything, share with your friends. Also, check out my social medias, man. Leave me a like or follow over there. Links to all that down below in the description box. We'll be streaming on the Twitch. We got a second channel, we got the merch, we got a Discord, and we got a Facebook page. So yeah, definitely go check it all out, man. I appreciate it again. Thank you guys. And yeah, man, it's been Boy Des, and we out.